Well, this is what they call a low-budget film, and uh, there are many restrictions uh, which everyone agrees to work under these conditions. But uh, I have found that, that everyone involved with this uh, picture seems to be extremely attentive, and uh, it's not only a learning process for some of them, but uh, they seem to have a very professional attitude, and it's an enjoyable surroundings to work in. No, I'm sorry. Tuesday he gets shot, Wednesday you get shot. Tuesday, Wednesday. Mm -hmm. it's, an, it's an interesting piece in which we're not really sure the motivations of each of the characters or where they're going to go or where they're going to end up. It's a drama and it's about good lighting, really. You know, bottom line, it's not about style or flair or you know, effects, things like that. It's just about good, good classical kind of camera work. So that's kind of what we're going for. It's a complex character study, and I, I think that we don't have a lot of those except in independent films now, and uh, I like anything that's character-based, and I think this has some fascinating characters. Good. Let's pick up the, just the last part of that. My name is Chris Pine. I'm playing Luther Scott, who uh, <laughs> has some major issues in this movie. I don't know. I find Luther pretty wonderfully complicated in a very almost normal teenage way. You know, he's a kid that's dealing with a lot of stuff. And he's just confused by a lot of things, and he doesn't know how to how to exactly confront his own demons. Chris doesn't look like you know, a Luther killer type person. So it's really great that he has this sweet face and um, can play a very demonic person. I love the, uh, the youthfulness that we have on the set. Like, everyone seems to be, you know, all young. Everybody's so young. Oh my God. Honestly, you guys are so young. These guys, I don't know who they think they are. These young guys come in and think they know the whole lot collectively across the board are just so young. God, yeah, so young. It's like a bunch of young people that are super motivated and focused and creative and great. Everybody's coming together to make this thing. It's, it's great. It's really fun. No, this is a very competent crew. It's my pleasure. It's my pleasure. I'm so grateful to be here and, and be working with, with, with people who are young and passionate. In fact, the whole crew's got their rhythm at this stage of the game. I mean, everyone's just sliding right in. They're gelling, everyone's working together. Real pleased. There's a bunch of dynamics that go on in a, on a movie set. It's a family, it's a high-stress family, it's a super dysfunctional family. Everybody has their own stuff going on, neuroses, whatnot. I'd say I'm not as stressed out as everyone else is. <laughs> Our dear director John has requested a breakaway confessional screen, so that's what we've provided him with. Watch closely, you can still kind of see my ugly face through the thing. So it doesn't get any better when I take it away. This is the making of a movie right here. How you like working on this? I think it's been fun. fun. It's been fun. I've been up in trees on ATVs. Second like like day. <laughs> you have fun today? It's alright out here. It's a little warm, some bugs, but yeah, not so bad. Don't got any ants in my shorts yet. Yeah. What's, what was the funnest part about confession for you? Uh, probably the people. Good people, good times. Yeah. That fourth day, we'll get that other rain tower, and I think that'll really bring it up in the courtyard, and then our foreground rain's gonna have to do the rest. So, so far, I've had a, a blast. I'm sure it'll be fantastic. I can't wait to see, I can't wait to see what we do.